Water pollution is a common environmental problem in the world today. Often we think of water pollution as caused by human activities, as was the case for the recent water crisis in Flint, Michigan. But is all water pollution caused by humans? Not always. For example, groundwater contamination by arsenic is a natural occurring process and is becoming a worldwide environmental issue. In South and Southeast Asia alone, more than 100 million people are exposed to arsenic-contaminated groundwater, leading to severe health problems including cancer and skin disease. Arsenic is a chemical element that is often found naturally in minerals. If you drop a rock containing arsenic into a cup of pure water, odds are not much will happen because most forms of the mineral are not soluble in water alone. However, if we add the right mix of microbial organisms and organic carbon into this cup and take out the oxygen, the mineral will break down and release arsenic into the water. Even though all this is happening naturally, human activities such as well drilling and irrigation can change the groundwater flow pattern and introduce more organic carbon that will further facilitate the arsenic release process. If your well water turns out to be contaminated, there are a few options to regain potable water in your household. The first option is to join a public water supply system. The second option is to install an arsenic filter for your well. The last option is to drill or switch to a new well that is more likely to produce arsenic-free groundwater. In less developed countries, the last option is often preferred due to the absence of a public water supply system or effective water monitoring and treatment equipment. Today, international science communities such as MIT have built many study sites in arsenic-affected regions. The research effort has also motivated programs that are in place to help affected populations regain clean drinking water.